Hello students, hope you all are fine. I am Dr. Paul Moe Vishash. I welcome you all in my channel Chemistry and Mystery of Molecules. So today we will discuss a topic that is a conversion of alkene into cis diol using osmium tetroxide. There are many methods. I will explain everything step by step in individual videos. Conversion of alkene into diols. Some is cis, some is trans. Okay, so today's topic is conversion of alkene to cis diol using osmium tetroxide as a catalyst. Uh, better to say catalyst or stoichiometric oxidant, whatever. So today's talk will cover few points like the basic idea of this reaction, reaction mechanism, role of other reagents, additive, other oxidants, and finally selectivity of this reaction, and at the end few examples to complete the. Uh, chemistry. So I believe this, uh, after watching the complete video, you will be able to learn about the basic of this osmium tetroxide based reaction. So if you want the part 2 of this means the others difficult example, please mention in the comment box. So let's start. So as you can see, this is alkene CC double bond and the pi bond is prone to oxidation compared to the sigma bond. So reaction happening on the pi bond. So it reacts with this osmium tetroxide. And what is the osmium osmium's oxidation state? That is A. This is a redox reaction. Okay. So after reaction C, this is oxidation happens one unit, one unit. So two unit oxidation. Okay, see one heteroatom attached to carbon means carbon oxidation state previously. It was if all are carbon means 0, 0, right now plus 1, plus 1. So, 2 unit exists. So, uh, seems at this context, the um, oxidants will be reduced to unit, and that also happened. It converted into actually osmium 3. 6 oxidation state. Okay, better you can think in this way. I'll explain it. So this is actually this is a redox reaction. So some are oxidized and reduced. And for this process, what happens? Pyridine acts as a catalyst. How? Pyridine co can coordinate the osmium center and facilitates the process. Second, there is some problem. This is volatile. So that problem is little bit little bit handled using pyridine. I'll explain other modifications also. And this reaction actually, uh, okay, let's discuss the mechanism, then thing will be clear. Actually, if we write it better way, this is osmium. Four double bond, actually it is a plus eight oxidation state. So what happens? This, see, this bond coming to osmium means this is a reduction. What it produces? This is actually a osmium ester. Why I am saying C is an alcohol linkage? It's an ester, organic ester. So what happened in the next step? So next step, these undergo hydrolysis. Hydrolysis means this hydrolysis. Please be careful. I will provide the proof why this not this bond. So hydrolysis and for this case hydrolysis is done under reducing environment. So NaHSO3 reducing environment. Why? Because product is a diol or better to say cis diol. So this alcohol may oxidize and in this case what happens actually this osmium is converted into osmium 6 you, you may write this as OSO3 or you may uh, or you may write this as HOH twice OSO2 means better to write or H2 OSO4 this is also 6 
Okay, so this is produced. Fine. So this is the overall mechanism. Now how this reaction happens? Actually, the reaction happens by attack of solvent molecules. Means for example, water on this side and in this way it opens. What is the proof? If you take osmium tetroxide level with O18, all are labeled. Okay, all are labeled. Ultimately, what you end up? End up alcohol having that label. So this observation proves that breakage happens here. Otherwise, if breakage happens here, then we would not get selectively this oxygen level with this. Okay. Now, whatever we have discussed, this is a stoichiometric reaction, but Osmium tetroxide is a, it is a costly and um, actually it is a costly and toxic, toxic material. So what happens if a material is costly as well as toxic, general tendency generally to use it as a stoichiometric reagent is not good. For that case, what can we do? We can make this stoichiometric process into catalytic process. How we can do this? We can do this by actually what the role of oxidant? This is actually oxidant. So if we take catalytic amount of oxidant, means catalytic amount of osmium tetroxide plus some oxidant. What is the role of oxidant? That osmium tetroxide, this osmium 8, when it converted into osmium 6, this oxidant will further oxidize, oxidized into this. What are the oxidants? Oxidants are, oxidants are, hydrogen peroxide, or N methyl morpholine oxide. Morpholine morpholine is this, N methyl is this, and morpholine oxide is this O minus N plus. Okay? So what happens? We know that hydrogen peroxide reduces into water. Means it oxidizes some water reducing water. What happens is N morpholine N methyl morpholine oxide? It reduces to corresponding N methyl morpholine. This is the lone pair region. So this is. And when this osmium is converted, this, so they oxidizes again. Okay. So this is. Now, now some other reason. For example, means see this osmium tetroxide is this osmium tetroxide is volatile. Toxic. So, do working with this laboratory is not safe. What is the safe precursor? The safe cat precursor for catalysis is potassium osmate. Just think, what is the oxidation state of this material? See, because this 2 oxygen, which is O minus plus 4, this, uh, sorry, plus 4, another plus 4 comes from, so it is also a plus 8 oxidation state. Similar, so that problem and another thing, it is water soluble. So, soluble in water. So, these are the advantage of using this which generates this in situ. Now, so these are the modification of this reaction. First of all, stoichiometry, second of all, catalytic. Yes. So, now let's, uh, let's discuss about the, okay, before going to selectivity, let's discuss about few examples. Okay, let's continue the discussion. Three examples, okay. So, first example, see it's a double bond alkene reacting with a cyclic alkene reacting with osmium tetroxide, ether, sodium bicarbonate, aqueous ethanol. Okay, what is the problem? First of all, one another important thing I should mention that osmium tetroxide reactions are carried out inert solvent. Keep this term in mind 
inert solvent like ether. First point. Second, this is aqueous bicarbonate. So, what it result? This result in a cis type. You can say up down depending on your wish. This. Second, this under the similar reaction condition, that's why I have written question. There is an interesting point. Actually, if you conf why I have given written this way, you can think the problem in this way also, but that will create difficulty to understand what is the product. Okay, so that's why I have written this thing. So, what is the product actually? First step osmium tetroxide, osmate ester formation. So, what is the osmate ester? Please be careful, look at carefully how I am writing. Okay, so this is right now osmium is osmium 6. Why this is? Because osmium tetroxide has unique property. What? First of all, it attacks from less crowded site less crowded side and second is more electron rich double bond. Keep this thing in mind. This is the selectivity for osmium tetroxide. Okay. So this is selectivity. Now question this. Why not other side? See in this way one oxygen is down means axial in this equatorial. If you think the another side means this is equatorial and this side one oxygen, then there is a chance of repulsion with this methyl group. That will direct the reaction in this way. And when this thing will be hydrolyzed, what will be the product? So diol will be formed in this side. So this is this is. So please keep it in mind. Such type of structures are very easy. This is little difficult, but not. And another thing, last example indicates the catalytic use of osmium tetroxide. When we use catalytic amount, then we need an oxidant. And for this purpose, see, hydrogen peroxide in tertiary butanol. This is acting as even. There are another uh, uh, oxidant available. I forgot to mention that is tertiary butyl hydroperoxide. This, this is also our organic hydroperoxide. So this characters. So what happens in this case? In this case, they produce. For example, you better to write in this way. It will be very good for you. This is also good. Or if you want to write, you can write this in another way also. So OH up or down. OH in bracket racemic. Sorry, I, I should not write racemic because this is already symmetry is there. Fine, this. Or you can write this part in this way also, if you want to write. So one is this, another is this. This version is also called cis. I will explain. We will teach uh, the cyclohexane chemistry. Or both, both right. So, but for high school student, I suggest you please follow this thing. It will be easier for you because cyclohexane doesn't belong to your syllabus. So fine. So this is the example of catalytic. So some when this osmium four is reduced to os osmium eight is reduced to six. It is reoxidized by this hydrogen toxin tertiary butanol. So this is the overall discussion of the first part. It's a basic thing. So thank you everyone for listening. We have learned today about the basic idea, reactivity, reaction mechanism, and stoichiometric osmium tetroxide to catalytic oxygen tetroxide, water soluble version, less, which is less toxic, harmful, and final its selectivity for reaction to the alkene. So this is the end of this discussion. I hope this video is useful for you. And if it is, please help my channel to grow. First of all, subscribe my channel Chemistry and Mystery of Molecule and please press the bell icon to get the notification of every single video I upload. I almost upload on a regular basis. If you don't uh, subscribe in that way, you may miss some videos. Secondly, share this video among your friends. And if many people got benefited from my effort, I shall be very happy. And most importantly, please like the video and make some good comments. These are the supplements for me to prepare new videos with more enthusiasm 
and if you think some modification suggestion rectification improvement essential please feel free to mention in the comment box but i also request you please give some suggestion along with criticism how to make it better so that for me and you both are getting benefited so thank you again take care see you in my next video